we can basically tag a Kubernetes cl cluster, add it to CodeFresh, and deploy. Stillhouse is awesome because we were working on great technology. You know, we're really trying to push the edge of what customers are expecting from an ad tech company. We wanted to switch away to a solution that was going to remove the work of maintaining uh, a Jenkins box, but also the foresight of using new technology like Kubernetes. On the migration of Kubernetes, we took a very strong, heavy-handed approach at dockerizing, containerizing everything, and then leveraging Helm charts to you know, help organize the deployment of Kubernetes. We currently deploy to two environments, IBM and AWS, for managed Kubernetes, and then we do that by using CodeFresh as our CI/CD pipeline. CodeFresh had the correct technology plus the hands-on experience and being able to communicate with their team that allowed us to be successful. When I started using it, it, it was really easy. I could see all the pipelines running, what is happening in the system. We had to deploy to like 20 different instances. You have to sit there and you have to watch, make sure that every five nodes, you know, five go down, five come back up, that everything goes smoothly. This new managed environment world using CodeFresh and Kubernetes, you just literally watch the pods go down and come back up and you don't have to worry about it at all. We can basically tag a Kubernetes cl cluster, add it to CodeFresh and deploy. I can focus on my job, which is development and design of, of software instead of taking care of all the infrastructure and build-related jobs that which I'm not focused on. With CodeFresh and Kubernetes together, uh, it's just allowed us to create more projects faster. Um, the ability to stand up a project that is production ready uh, takes a fraction of the time. Between the Helm charts, the CodeFresh builds, Kubernetes, we've got a production-ready environment within a few minutes. 